Ella swim. Ella, it's time to go to school. Today you have a sports class. Your class chosen swimming lessons. Mom, I don't want to go to school. I can't swim. I don't like swimming. That's why you have to learn to swim. But... Hurry up and change clothes. I bought you a swimsuit. Remember to put it in your bag. I'm waiting for you in front of the house. I know, Mom. Today we will learn to swim. Teacher Ken. I don't see Ella anywhere. Is she late again? Tina, you wear a beautiful swimsuit. Thank you. This is high-end swimwear. It's admirable. Sorry, Teacher Ken. I'm late. You go to the bathroom to change clothes. I don't bring it. I forgot. Really? That's right. I forgot my swimsuit. Ella. You don't have to swim anymore. But the next time, you have to bring a swimsuit. Yes, Teacher Ken. Ella. Where are your swimsuits? I forgot it. If so, your score today will be 0%. What do you say? Ella, today is a swimming class. Why didn't you bring a swimsuit? Teacher Ken. Ella, I brought an extra set. Please use it. Amy. Thank you. You should go in and change your clothes. I know. Ella. Everyone can stand in the pool. Some people can swim. There's only you left. To know how to swim, you must be able to breathe underwater. Come on. Let's go down to the pool. But this pool is too deep. This pool is not deep. Teacher Ken. I will go first. Tina. Do you know how to swim? That's right. I knew how to swim when I was in first grade. Tina, let's try swimming. Watching Tina swim is so fun. 
Come on, everyone. Jump into the pool. Yes, teacher Ken. Ella, why don't you come down? I'm terrified. I don't dare go down. I have to use a float. Ella, quickly remove the float. You must swim. I'm very scared. I can't do it. She's so stubborn. She didn't dare leave the float. Hello. Teacher Ken? Miss Evie, Ella will fail the swim activity. She didn't dare go into the pool. She only uses the float. Ella doesn't like swimming. She is afraid of going to the swimming pool. Really? If so, here's the problem. Can you change her subject? This is a regulated activity. I cannot change. Teacher Ken, I have an idea. That's a good idea, Miss Evie. I'll do it now. I hope it's okay. Ella, the swimming test is coming up. I know you're afraid of swimming, but you have to take the test. If you don't remove the float, you will get zero percent. Teacher Ken, I'm terrified. If you can swim, I'll buy you a premium Tim Tim cake. Teacher Ken, really? That's right. I am a teacher. I never lie. But it's really difficult. Please practice. Only one week left until the test. Ella, I trust you. You can do it. Teacher Ken, thank you. Ella, what's wrong with you? Are you not happy, Andy? I. It turns out that's all. Ella, near my house, there is a swimming pool. We will practice. I'll help you. But. Don't worry. You will pass the test. You will have Tim Tim cake. Really? That's right. Please believe me. Ella, please remove the float. But. Look at me. Please imitate me. Use both hands, Ella. You start to do it. You are doing well. Andy, thank you. 
but I still haven't mastered it. You can now swim. You just don't have the courage. So what can I do? You have to be confident. Tomorrow, we will practice one last time. Thank you, Andy. It's really hot today. Luckily, I went swimming. Ella, come on. You can do it. What? Is that Ella? Is she practicing swimming? Looking at her is so funny. <laughs> Hi, Ella. Hi, Cora. I didn't expect to see you here. Today is hot. So I come here. Ella, this boy is... This is Cora. She is my neighbor. Hi, Cora. I'm Andy. I'm Ella's friend. Hi, Andy. You look smart. Do you teach Ella how to swim? That's right. Next week, Ella will have a test. Ella, you have to try harder. I get it. Looking at Ella diligently. I no longer hate her. She is a cute girl. <laughs> Ella, did you fart? Oh my god! Ella! You should not fart in the swimming pool! I'm sorry. It was unintentional. Cora, you! You just farted! I didn't! You heard wrong! I heard correctly. Cora, you hate farting. But you just farted. <laughs> What a shame! Why am I like that? Hey, miss. What is up? We checked the camera. You just farted. You have polluted the swimming pool. What? You are fined $100. Please pay the fine according to the instructions. Ella. It's all because of her. I hate her. Ella. Everyone has finished their task. There's only you left. You need to swim from here to the other side. I know. Andy told me to be confident. I can do it. Ella.
Try your best. Ella, you can do it. I feel so tired. Ella, you have swum halfway. Ella, you did it. Ella, what's up? Wake up, Ella. Ella, you are awake. Mom, teacher Ken, where am I? This is the school health room. You fainted. Teacher Ken, about the test. You get 90%. Really? But I still need to finish. You are almost at the finish line. But you fainted. However, I understand you. You have tried very hard. So I give you the score of 90%. Teacher Ken. Ella, as promised, here is your reward. This is a premium Tim Tim cake. I like it so much. Teacher Ken. Thank you. Ella, as long as you try, you can do everything. I got it. <laughs> Ella, did you just fart? I can't stand it anymore. The room smells so bad. Mom and teacher Ken ran out. Even though the room was smelly, the cake was delicious. I'm no longer afraid of swimming. Why can Ella swim? A. She is afraid of getting bad grades. B. She has Andy to help her. C. She wants premium Tim Tim cakes. D. All answers above. If you like my channel, you can subscribe to watch more videos about my stories. Thank you very much.